All right, so this is a uh, demo video for my project that we made. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to open up the, the project. And the first thing, you want to go to the startup file. And uh, the basic steps to, to get the database to work on your, your program is uh, you're going to want MySQL installed on your, your program or your, your computer. And then you're going to want to create a username Scott with a password of Tiger. And this is very important that it is hard coded into the code that you have a username Scott with a password of Tiger. Also, with a you have to create a database called Aztec Task Manager, no spaces, no capitals. Grant all the privileges to Scott. Use the database, and then you're going to use this dump file here. What this dump file does is it basically is a way to transfer the uh, the contents of a database to another database, so you, so it'll, it'll transfer all of the uh, the tables and all the data and all the the uh, relationships and stuff like that. So after you get that all set up, I know me and Ruben had some me and Professor Ruben had some some issues with doing this, so this is why I'm making this video. You're gonna go into the DIST folder, go to the executable jar file. That is the the way to start up the program. Now I already have a program in here. But what you're going to want to do is you're going to go create project. Let's just say housework. And do tomorrow. And housework. Okay. So we can create some tasks for it. Mm, dishes. Now notice only the projects that I have will show up, which is very good for validation. And dishes. Oh, I'm um, uh, sweep for. Sweet floors. Let's create another project. Lawn. And we can have that due on the 20th. No, no tasks yet, so no. Lawn. Notice the lawn now appears. Oops. Okay. And there it is. Now, another thing, if you click on one of these, it goes away. Also, you can go to the delete project. Select your project. Let's go delete this random one I made. And now it's gone. Now the cool thing is, is since this is using a database, I can completely close out of the program, open it back up, and my stuff is still here. That is because if you go down to the NetBeans, and if I go to project, it is physically implementing this into a database. So here's all my my stuff. Then here is the tasks. Over here, sweep, mow, or mow and sweep floors. Now, what's interesting is if I take this and I view the data and I truncate the data, which basically means delete. Okay, so I'm going to do that. It deletes all the. Now, if I go back to my project, let me reopen it. Now everything's gone because it's using a database. So, that's the basic gist of the program. I hope you enjoyed this.